Hey, what is up guys? It's Brody Thomas here, and today this video is going to be talking about the end of Jimmy Kimmel, which will be summarizing why Jimmy Kimmel is getting all of this hate and why he technically deserves it. Now, we're going to start off with who is Jimmy Kimmel? James Christian Kimmel is an American television host, comedian, writer, and producer. He is the host and executive producer of Jimmy Kimmel Live, a late night talk show that premiered on ABC in like January. He's 52 years old and he's actually hosting the Emmys for 2020. Kimmel's late night talk show was also very big and had celebrities such as Kobe Bryant, Robert Downey Jr., and even the former president of the United States, Barack Obama. Now this section will be talking about the first offense that Jimmy Kimmel did and what he got caught up with a few days ago. A few days ago, Jimmy Kimmel was exposed for blackface sketches he performed when he was on Comedy Central's The Man Show in the late 90s to the early 2000s. He was shown as NBA star Karl Malone in a parody of Oprah Winfrey as Oprah Jimfrey. These sketches sparked outrage as an effect of the big Black Lives Matter movement is in full effect of the American nation. This, however, didn't force Kimmel nor his team to speak about the sketches, but could be a reason why he is taking a two-month break from his job. Last Thursday, Kimmel announced that he's taken a summer vacation, which is really a two-month break, in which he stated, I've been doing this job for almost 18 years, he said. He said he's done literally 3,130 shows, and there's nothing wrong. My family is healthy. I'm healthy. I just need a couple months off, when really he failed to mention the man show controversy. This last section of the video will be about Jimmy Kimmel's second offense, which was him saying the N-word multiple times back in the 90s, early 2000s. According to the New York Post, Jimmy Kimmel reportedly used the N-word while imitating Snoop Dogg in 1996 and admitted years ago that he imitated the rapper Snoop Dogg's voice for a track in a 1996 Christmas album, which was an original song in which Kimmel used the N-word several times. He also tried to attempt to adopt the voice of a black comedian, George Wallace, in what host Adam Carolla called Kimmel's crazy black voice. Kimmel acknowledged imitating black people on other occasions as well, not just this one. End of story is that Jimmy Kimmel could possibly be canceled for this, unlike Jimmy Fallon, and that his future is not looking good so far. If you guys liked it, make sure to subscribe, leave a like, comment, and share to your friends, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.